Hello everybody, Tiny Tackless. Hope you're having a good thumbs up day, a good thumbs up week and weekend. Now remember, Tiny is always happy to see you and have a ball in its hands. The Tiny is going to do a little bit of wild animal movements. And then Leon, my trusted demonstrator and helper, is going to help me. And then also, we're going to do a little bit of where you get the ball and you throw it, pick it up and throw it. Now, if you're ready, make sure you've got your ball. Make sure you've got a water bottle. If you don't have a ball, you can have toilet paper. Or, look, we've got monkey again. The soft toy, any soft toy that you can safely throw around inside, you can use. Are you ready then? Okay, ready to go. Now, first thing we're going to do is we are going to do silly baboon. Now, you're going to be on the one spot and you're going to run fast as you can, fast as you can. Keep the ball in front of you as long as you can and stop. Right, now we're going to go again. Now, this time, make sure when you go silly baboon, the feet are so fast, okay? If you've got space, you can go forward a bit, backward a bit. Okay, are you ready? Steady, go. One, two, quick, faster, faster, faster. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Shh, hold back. Good job. Now, can you do it another two times? Good job, everybody. Do a bit of starfish jumping. So it's like a star jump. So put your ball down. Make sure you don't count, step on anything. And then it's going to be... Star jumps, okay? Now, I'm gonna get Leon to come and do it. Leon, just keep that rolling. Come, give me the uh, camera. And Leon, I want you to do 10 star jumps. Are you ready, Leon? Leon, are you ready? Star yeah. jumps, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, stop. I was st star jumps counting to 10. Now, can you do 30 seconds worth of start, start jumps? Ready? Go. That's it. Keep going. If you are little and you can only do 10 seconds, that's fine. If you're a bit older and you can get to 30 seconds, brilliant. So Leon is going and he's almost at 30 seconds. All right, Leon, can you stop now? Well done, Leon. Thank you very much. Now, can, uh, you can see Leon is ready. He's now going to do a snowshoe hair hop. Now, we're going to start off by putting our hands between our legs, everybody. Tiny tackless. Can you see Leon has got his blue tiny tackless t-shirt on? I love it. I've got my green one on. But he's going to jump. Now, snowshoe sh hair has got big back feet. You can jump and they can land with their feet together. Right, Leon, can you jump um, forward and then you walk, go back and then jump again. Do five of those. Good jump. If you let little, try and just jump and land with your feet together like Leon is going back. That's three. Now see how many you can do. If you can do up to five, brilliant. That's five and Leon is going back. Now Leon is going to stand up. And he's going to pretend he's on the snow with his um, feet, the front feet up. And this snowshoe shoe hair can jump really high um, on the snow. And because their feet are so big, they can land on the snow. But they land with their feet together. Leon, can you do that as high as you can? And then back again. And then back again. Good. Just jump and then walk back. That's it. You can walk back, everybody, and jump. See if you can do five high ones. Don't run into anything in the house. That's a little, one big high one. And his feet is together. All right. Now, Tiny Tackless are here. Leon is ready. Now, he is going to do the gorilla shuffle. Now, first, he's going to do shuffle for, on all fours going forward. There's a ball or a soft way a little bit further. He's going to touch that and then he's going to shuffle back. You only have to do a meter. If you want, if you've got more space, you can do longer, further than that. Let's go for three forwards and back, Leon. 
Gorilla, gorilla shuffles. Go, Tiny Tactics. Let's have a look first. You touch the ball, your mango, your banana. That's it. And then now he's going to go on a sideways shuffle. Three on that side and three on the other side. So um, hands on the floor. And then he's hanging, he's ready to go. And now you go, Leon. And he's scooping it, but there you go, scoop it. And then that's your, now your third one, sideways. All right, now can you turn around to do the other from the other side? Shuffle, shuffle, sideways. Stay nice and low, bend your knees, little tiny tacklers. If you can bend your knees, can you do three? You don't have to be going too far. One more, Leon, that everybody can see. That's great. That's your gorilla sideways shuffles. You did forwards and you did uh, some back. See how many can you do. And now, big chest bumps. But Leon, let's show your uh, gorilla chest bumps. Nice. Chimpanzee or chimpanzee as we call it in South Africa. If you're Afrikaans that is. Hey everybody, Tiny Tackers. Now, you've done this before. We're going to do a chimpanzee. And remember, chimpanzee's got long fingers. And now a chimpanzee is happy to go and pick up stuff. And then, you know, once they pick it up with their long fingers, they can take it and potentially it's just a mango or maybe a banana or something and they can eat it. So, what do chimpanzees do? They go nice and low with their knees, bend their knees. Nice and low, scurry, scurry, and then they scoop with their long uh, fingers, and then they've got that hanger, and they put it back, and then you go again. So you go, nice and low, bend your knees, scoop it. There you go, eat, 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 put it back. And now, sideways, so it's nice and low, scoop, and there you go, back you go. And now, can we try the other side? And then you go, there we go, there you go, thank you. Good job, Jack. Now put it back down again. Now everybody, you're going to see Jack is now with us. He's got his pink tiny tuckers t-shirt. Look at us. All looking good. Now we're going to do our scurry. Now a chimpanzee's fingers, remember, are long. So they're going to scoop underneath the soft toy of the ball. And they're going to make sure they go low and bend your knees. Scoop. And then, hum, hum, and then put it back. And then back here again and go again. Right. Jack, are you ready? We're going to do it three times. So are you ready? Mm -hmm. You guys ready? Mm -hmm. Now run to the soft toy and scoop. And then put it back down again and start again. Run and scoop. Remember to bend your knees. So make sure that you're in a safe place. You don't bump heads anybody. Now can you do it from the other side with your other hand? Ready? Uh, run, run, run and scoop. Now. Remember, you got to make sure you look at the ball or the, or the soft toy or your banana. Now, up you get then, don't fall over in your, in your um, living room. Go. That's it. And Leon, can you go back a bit? Short steps. And then low. And that's a good one. And then down. Well done. Can you do it at least 10 times? See if you can do it. You don't have to go far. You only have to be short. Good job. But if you've done that chimpanzee, all of that scurry and scooping, that's brilliant. Now we're gonna go and do a monkey balance ball tap. Now this is very important, I'm gonna show you one. Doesn't matter if it's a ball, or soft toy, or a rugby ball, doesn't matter. You start, you run up, and you touch it with your foot. Then you run up, and you touch it back, and you touch it with your foot. You run up, touch it with your foot. You run back, ready, and touch it with your other foot. Then you go again, run up, touch it with your hand, run back, touch it with your hand, and then you go. If you're little and you just want to walk back, you can tap with your hand, walk back, tap with the other hand, bend your knees, and walk back. Or run, 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 tap with your foot, back, back, back. Stop if you're tired, but try and do at least 10 of them. So let's see how Leon goes with it. Leon, are you ready? Go. Yeah. Now Leon is ready to do the monkey balance ball taps. Are you ready, Leon? Mm -hmm. Right, two with your feet, different, uh, change your feet over, and then two with your hand. And do that four times. Ready, steady, go. 
Now you can do quick feet or you can walk up. Depends on how old you are. And then Leona's gonna just change up again to his. Oh, make sure you keep your balance. Right. Good job. Yeah, you can. Now, Leona's going to show us how he balances for three seconds per tap. Remember the taps are not standing on your, uh, your ball or your soft toy. It's about tapping and keeping your balance. He's keeping his balance there for three seconds. Okay, ready, steady, go. Bend your, bend your knee of your other leg. Good, now just foot taps on and keep it for three seconds, okay? Well done, now bend your knee every time you get, get close. The other knee, the knee that you're standing on, you gotta bend, see how long. Bend lower, bend lower. Try and keep your, your tap foot long, okay? Good job, well done. Good job. That's it, everybody. Try and do a few of those where you tap on and keep your balance for three seconds. Okay, well done, Leon. Good job. Now, well done, everybody. That was a bit of balance. Now, we're just going to do sideways walking, see how you do with those. This is tiny going through the river in Africa or in, in South America, uh, the Amazon River. So, there you're going to be strong to go for, past. Keep your back back nice and uh, dry. Keep it nice and high. So we're going sideways. So you're going to try and make sure if you go sideways, you step. Big steps. You keep the ball nice and high. That's great. So if you want to do a couple of steps, not like that, sorry. You're going to go sideways, sideways, and then sideways back. Okay, pretend you're going to, through the river. Sideways, sideways, keep that ball nice and high because that's your backpack, you want to keep it dry. So see if you can do at least 20 seconds of sideways walking, okay? Sideways and sideways. Good job! Now Leon is going to pretend he's tiny and tiny is on an adventure going through the Amazon River or the rivers in Africa, the Nile River. And they are strong rivers those. Ooh. And then he's gonna walk sideways, keeping his backpack nice and dry. And he is going sideways through the strong river. So he walk big side steps. Leon, you can go. Big side steps. And then that's it. And then you go back. And then see how many you can do in 30 seconds. Can you keep doing that? Keeping the ball nice and high. That's it. Big side steps, okay? Really good. That is great. Side steps. You've got about 10 seconds left, Leon. Now, everybody, um, once you get a chance, have a look and then have a go. See if you can do 20 seconds. Well done, Leon. Give us a thumbs up. Good job. Oh. Everybody, Leon is going to do sideway baboon skips and they're going to pretend he's showing his a banana to everybody, his bananas to everybody. Okay, are you ready, Leon? Sideways skips. And then, and it goes the other way. Sideways skips. Remember to show the ball, but you go sideways. Now, can you go low? Bend your knees low. And again, keep doing that for about 30 seconds of how long you can. Leon has been really good. He's going to show us and tiny tacklers now there is going to be a monkey um throwing the banana so what we're going to do is you're going to put the ball yeah you can make some monkey noises if you want but put the ball on the floor and then you're going to pick it touch your knees with the ball and then you're going to throw it okay see if you can do a few of those just demonstrate that's a good throw now remember monkey once you picked it up Touch your knees and then throw it with your hands going to where you want the, the banana to go, the ball to go or the soft toy to go. Leon, are you ready? Okay, good. Pick up your ball. 
touch your knee and throw. Good job. Into the camera. That was a good one. Last one then. Okay, that's great. Now everybody, can you do monkey throws? You can have a go. All right, well done, Leon. Now everybody, Leon is ready. You can see he's put a soft toy. He's fat cat over there. Now Leon is gonna do a little uh, predator crawl and pounce. Now I want you guys to know you gotta be nice and low. You crawl closer, you're stalking it. So it's a stalk and pounce. You can be a tiger, you can be a lion, you can be a panther, you can be a leopard, but you're gonna try and stalk it and be nice and low. And then you're gonna pounce onto a soft toy that you've got there. But don't do it with soft, soft toys, you gotta do the actions. Are you ready, Leon? So nice and low, crawling, all fours. And then when you're ready, when you close, show your fever and pounce. That's it. And then you go back, reverse back, reverse back. You can reverse back as well. Now, if you're little, you little can try and be stay on uh, your knees off the floor. And then when you close, nice and low, then you can pounce. Good. Now, see how many times you can do that. All right. Leon is going to do it once more and then you can have a go. So now Leon, make sure you're nice and low when you crawl. You're stalking, stalking, take your time. Now you're quiet and then you got to pounce. Just jump as uh, big as you can onto it. Well done. That's what we're going to do. Uh, predator, stalk and pounce. Okay everybody, that was your warm up. Make sure, and that's wild animals, exercises, movements, and a bit of skill that you do. Skill is when you do something that you get good at, and that's ball skills, picking up a ball, throwing a ball, running. You know, Leon is a, what are you, a, a lion or a panther? <coughs> panther. Now, lions, panthers, all the animals, you got to monkeys. You gotta go to the water hole now and get yourself some water. Take a minute, get some water. There's your water, Leon. There you go. Good. Yeah, I hope you guys have all had a bit of sip of water and a bit of rest. Now we're gonna go into something which we call the pass it from the base. And this is, we're gonna pretend we're chimpanzees. Of course, chimpanzees can pick up a ball. Now, first thing I want you to do to just test yourself and practice is so you walk over the ball, touch it on the side, and you go back. Leon, can you see that ball? Mm -hmm. Right. Now, you're going to go, you go over the ball, touch the side, and then you go back again. You go again, step over the ball, touch the side, and then you go again. All right. Leon is going to do this. Don't stop it, Leon. Your turn. Now, Leon is going to do this. All right. Let's see. So you're going to do it five times if you can. Right, walk to the ball, step over and touch it on the side. No, you step over, keep the ball in the middle, one foot over, touch it with both hands, okay? That's it. Now bend your knees when you touch it. Good. Now that's, that's three. Now two more. Good. Now last one. Good job. Okay, chimpanzees, that's easy, isn't it? Now, you guys are gonna go fast. I know you're going really fast. Even the little ones are really, really fast. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna run to the ball, step over, touch it, and throw, okay? So look at this. I've got a couple of targets here. I'm gonna try and throw there, but I'm gonna be quick. Run, 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 step over, bend my knees, pick it up, and throw, okay? Now, Leona's gonna show us as well, but very important, you look at the ball, you might get short steps, you get short monkey steps, chimpanzee steps, pick it up and you throw, okay? See how many times you can do that, okay? Very easy. Look at the ball, short step, step over, pick up, bend your knees, pick up, look where you're going to throw, and throw the ball. Okay, are you ready? Now let's go. Leon is going to show us. Okay, Leon, go. No. Chimpanzees, remember you're trying to pick up the ball, but now you're gonna run, pick up the ball and throw it back the other way. Look at the ball, step over, throw. Now get your ball again, put it back there, and then see how many you can do. If you can do five, um, find a target where you're gonna throw, make sure it's safe, 
Okay, Leon, can you put the ball a bit further forward? That's it. Now you run to it, short your steps, step over and throw. Okay, well done. Now let's do the next bit, okay? You guys have a go and then we'll see you in the, on the next bit. Now Leon is there ready. He doesn't look ready, but he's ready. Next to him, over there you can see his bucket. Or it can be a brother or sister or another parent or another target. Leon is going to now practice. He's going to run. He's going to try and throw that ball from the floor. So he is a chimpanzee. Remember, you look at the ball. You step over the ball. Leon, can you just run up, short step, step over the ball. And then you throw your hands into a really good throw. Now you get it back again. You put a ball back where you want it. And then see how many times you can practice that really well. So Leon is measuring it out. We're safe. Now short step, look at the ball, bend your knees, pick it up, step over and into your target or to someone's hands. You can do it once more, Leon. Let's have a look. Now go and throw. Good job. That's really good. Now if you're little, you, you make sure you don't stand that far back. So Leon, can you can you put the ball back to the middle? Pretend you are um, two years old. So you walk up, you step over, and then you get close enough and you throw it in. Okay, see how many can you do. Well done, everybody. Okay, everybody. Well done. We've got a challenge for you. Now, as a chimpanzee, you have got those long fingers, you've got balance, you can step over, you can throw your banana. Now, Leon is going to explain. The challenge is, can you do it three times in a row? Yeah. We've got, over here, you'll see, Leon, in a minute, um, you'll see we've got our target there, the bucket, and he's going to try and throw it in there. Now, there's your challenge, Leon. Everybody, Leon, the chimpanzee, pretend... He's going to run far because he's a bit bigger. You can be closer if you're little, but he's going to try and do it three in a row. Are you ready, Leon? Yeah! <laughs> now, he's done really well. Can he do this last challenge? Now, I want to challenge everybody. You can be closer, but Leon is going to try and do it from a bit further. Remember, you got to look at the ball. Short steps when you get close. Step over the ball and then... Make sure you look at the target and push your hands to the target. Leon is going to try and do three in a row. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. Steady, go. Step over. Okay, he had a couple of goes at that just to get himself ready. Now, Leon, that's it. He's got his measure. He wants... Now, this is second attempt. Step over. Okay, now, remember, we're trying to pass the ball from the floor so if you pick it up and you don't pass it immediately that's not a go so Leon at the moment you're picking it up and then you wait till you pass you got to pick it up and throw good now guys if you can do it three in a row I gotta let Leon go carry on if you can do three in a row that's your challenge if you do more than that fantastic if you get a target that's two Leon can you do it from the floor you pick it up and throw immediately you look to your target you step over here bend your knees you look at your target and you throw immediately good that's brilliant that's your challenge everybody we'll see if you've got a video you want to send us send it to us tag us if you said it or put it on social media well done leon he's carrying on if you're small remember you can go very close you can try and get it in a bucket any way you want but try and from the pickup to do it immediately into the bucket. Right, see you next time.